song. Uh, this album different than any other album you've ever put into the world. Any other, I mean, you've covered songs before, but uh, this album not is like this. not like this, right? This is totally different. Yeah. You're doing it's a cover great. Album. Yeah, it's, it's super awesome. We're super happy we get to do this concept album with songs that are, that are so legendary. Um, these songs, our parents used to listen to them. We used to go to school, you know, and they would play them. So it's something crazy that we get to do these songs that are, you know, really huge songs. The Latin community, even Heroes was big here too. Um, there's many songs that, that, um, that many people knew and now we're beginning to back with our flow and we're super happy how they turned out. Did the pandemic kind of change your plans? Like, were you guys working on the covers album before? What were you working on before? How did we get to the covers album? We had a, so this album, this album um, came from, from quarantine time, definitely. Like we was, I'm um, planning to have another album before the quarantine. Yeah. Um, and then this idea comes um, and, and, and was like, let's work in this. Cause we're still like working in the other album. We want to like um, make, <clears throat> some songs like perfect and we want to like, work some songs exactly mm -hmm. so we like start working in this one and, and was perfect man but we also had a tour that was actually going to start in uh beginning of june yeah in the united states um so that kind of you know it got, got ruined but at the end of the day we got other things we had like a plan b which was this album we also um were working on other stuff so there's a lot of things are going to be coming out soon that we've been working on Non-stopping. The, the pause is kind of like a blessing in a sense, right? Like you get to reconnect with your family and life outside of work and music. But at the same time, you get a chance to listen to the album and soak in the album that maybe you were going to put out there. And I don't know, like for, for a lot of reasons, growth, yes? I love it for sure. Yeah, that's the, that's the, the best thing about, that happened with this. You know, sometimes you think that you have something so ready that when you have time to listen back to it, you're like, oh, man. All right, we, we could do this better, you know. Yeah. So that's what happened with this with the album that we were gonna drop. You know, this um this quarantine also gave us time to like listen back and we're like, oh damn, all right, cool. So now we have time to rework these songs and make them better, you know, and maybe place it in a different market than we were thinking of, you know, um stuff like that. And then it, it it gave us the idea to just create something that will make people happy in this time. You know? well, that's it. Like I think deja vu is very much needed right now. Because I think yeah. the album has the potential to connect generations and also oh. really repackage music that is timeless and educate people. Because there's a lot of people out there who haven't been in the know on these songs, but they're about to hear it in a whole new way. I think it's very, very cool. It's very cool. And what we love about this concert is, is that our fans... We'll, we will have they will have the opportunity to like connect maybe with their parents that they they know those songs those classic songs Perfect. for them for sure like means a, like a lot. a lot um so i think could be a, a special moment between fa a father or mother and, and son you know what i mean so i think it's kind of cool 